What's going on guys? This is Pop Porcelli here from NicheGamer.com. I've got an unboxing here for you all. And this is actually for a game that just came out. And I'm actually not sure what's even in this thing. This is a, this is a fun experience, this box right here. I have literally no idea what's in this thing. So, but it's actually for this game called Green Hell. It just came out. And the folks were like, hey, we want to send you a box with stuff. And I'm like, okay, that sounds cool. So, let's see what's in this crazy... <laughs> oh, my God. What, what, <laughs> what is this? <laughs> oh, my God, look at this thing. That's pretty cool. So, for those who don't know... Green Hell is a survival jungle game. You know, you're thrown into the jungle and you have to uh, survive. So this is basically, I'm assuming, stuff to help you survive in the jungle. So how do you, uh, how do you open this thing? This is like all stuck together. What is, uh... Oh. Oh, wow. I think, I think it's supposed to open, yeah. It's supposed to open the other way, let me see. So let's uh, let's get this bad boy open. Ah, so we've got a uh, we've got a shirt. Got a little shirt here. This is this is really cool. I love t-shirts. This is this is known fact right here. I love t-shirts. So that's pretty freaking cool. It's got a little capybara with some sunglasses. Look. <laughs> What is this? <laughs> and it says survived 36 days, traveled 40, 42 kilometers, vomited 13 times. That, that that's pretty cute. That's pretty cute. I like that. That's <laughs> look at the cap. <laughs> that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Um anyway, so this is like a bunch of polaroids. They're like like mock up Polaroids here. Let's see if I can get this uh, in better view of the of the camera. I'm trying to get these things out, but they're like wedged in there. So this is the little booklet talking about the game and the team creepy jar. So a small indie studio made up of former Techland employees. So some fine folks there. And uh, FYI, the review for Green Hell from us will be going up very shortly. Got a little USB stick right there. It's cute. It's it's actually that's like solid metal. Nice. This is probably some sort of like weather resistant, you know, metal. That's pretty cool. Um, but let me try getting these Polaroids out. I'm like trying. I don't want to damage them. So as you know, it's a jungle survival game. So you got some little photos of some indigenous folks right there. You got some like waterfall action right there. Got a little hut going on, and uh, some other cool. This lo it looks like concept art, but these are you know, made to look and feel like pol Polaroids. It's pretty cool. So actually, <laughs> it looks like yeah, this is photo film. That that's pretty cool. So it is printed on photo film. And here is the the piece de resistance. This is the main thing. So this looks like a little survival man purse type thing, you know. So you got a little little strap to put on your waist there and this is pretty this is pretty cool actually this feels like it's a pretty like a burlap like a rugged burlap material here and uh this looks like a ooh. so this is a little little multi-tool here so you've got your letter your letter opener a box opener you've got a cell phone stand, a can opener, a bottle opener. You've got various measurements here. And uh, also a screwdriver, too. That's pretty freaking cool. And a little measurement thing there, too. So, yeah, that's like that's a really neat little idea there. It's like a little survival multi-tool. That's pretty cool. So, anyway, let's look at the rest of this thing. So, that's the multi-tool. I feel like there's something else in here. So this, ooh, whoa, okay, 
So we've got some uh, some mints, I think. Oh, that's. <laughs> are those real bugs? Are the like are these real? They look like real bugs. I think these might be real bugs, dude. <laughs> oh my god, they smell like real bugs too. Dude, they they actually sent me real bugs. <laughs> Are you serious? Dude, that, like, look at that. Get a shot of that. They sent me real bugs. So, uh, protein, I, I guess. <laughs> okay. And this looks like a, what is this? It's a gel compress, so, so basically, you can wash it by hand, you know, and you can get this cool, so it's, it's meant to be, you know, case you get like bruised or something it's meant to help be a cold compress that's interesting so we've got a what is this this is this these look like matches or something oh yeah you got a little box of matches right here look at that Oof. that's a waterproof safety oh, they're waterproof what that's awesome man the doomsday prepper in me is literally shaking right now and we got a little little wristband right here I forget what these are for, but I mean, you know, outside of just being a wristband, but that's pretty cute. You know, it's like pretty, pretty rugged right there. So that's cool. And uh, last but not least, we have a commando wire saw. <laughs> what? Are you serious? Look at this thing. You can actually, this is like, you can cut through stuff with this, man. You, you can cut through necks with this, too. <laughs> like if you wanted to assassinate people you could literally murder people with this and I, I can i can see now why the amazing pr folks had issues with this coming through customs because of the bugs and the literal cord that you can murder people with and uh yeah thank you guys so much for sending this you know and this is this is really really awesome it's it it, it, it doesn't happen that often but we do get some cool stuff for all the work that we do for all the cool games that we show off and expect the review for green hell very shortly and we will be streaming the game too streams will be continuing soon and make sure you like subscribe all that fun stuff and we will see you guys again shortly